my email uh, inbox. Now, these are YouTube 22 messages. That is 22 uh, videos deleted. Good morning and win forever. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Timothy Profitable. And uh, today, this morning, I'm going into this very fast and it is very, very fast. Uh, today in the morning, I uh, woke up to um, email notification uh, saying uh, all my videos related to uh, Squan or rather related to Mummy Evelyn have been pulled down in YouTube. And uh, I think it's a good thing uh, to note that also. And uh, definitely now you can see Go TV is already at all loggerheads. DSTV is also as loggerhead as a platform. YouTube joined it exactly. Now, I believe there are some other places and some other social kind of areas would be. And uh, of course, as we've been doing uh, analysis, analytics, and something kind of, and uh, I believe it's not an, uh, it's not anything to personal. That is, and uh, I believe also that uh, this is something that all of us are obligated to do, especially Christian faith, when it's turning into that gap as Christian faith. Now. What I've realized also is that the entire media fraternity across the globe has risen up against one media station, and that is uh, Emmanuel TV. When, when we see Emmanuel TV under loggerheads of this kind, there must be reasons why uh, we can see. Now, just to cap on that, because this video, I believe it will not be so long. It will be a very short video so far. When you want to see something genuinely in a, a relationship to faith and uh, uh, religion, let me quote it, religion, you see, you will realize uh, there are a lot of things that happen. And when a lot of things happen, one of the things that happen in between the religion clashes it's warfare now look at how many people are doing warfare against Emmanuel TV you will realize we have uh, uh, all manner of queer uh, behavior I know I want I'm, I'm trying to censor some words because you, YouTube also don't like some other mentions of words in um, in, in, in some channels of this kind because all the battles against Kwan are from the other kind of faith is 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 open is is an obvious thing now that it's two kingdoms fighting so if you check and relate the other kingdom and this our kingdom of Jesus Christ now you can see those who want to know, I use this indication of uh, who is legit, who is for God, who is genuine. You will realize now how many people fighting Squan, fighting T.B. Joshua, fighting Mama Evelyn, fighting Emmanuel TV. You will know these are not born again entities. You will know these are not people who are coming to fight just for identity. It is definitely and openly now a spiritual warfare really taking roots in a high dimension. Spiritual warfare taking deep, deep, and they are digging. And the previous wars you've seen until this, now they are using entities who will want to join the battle. They are using them as tools. We talked about tongue. They are just tools in the hand of a warfare. And they may not even know. The former disciples of Tibi they may be joining this warfare and they don't even know it's part of their warfare. That's why I'm talking about some people also who come into my channel and be commenting some things here and there. And I realize also they are not spiritual enough or discerning enough to know that they are in the hands usable 
by the other kingdom opposite to our kingdom of God and they are used to distract the attention of what is called globalization of Christian faith or Christ-like faith. It's an old world. Now, this uh, Scorn and T.B. Joshua uh, attack from the other people is definitely a faith attack. Spiritual warfare. I will tell you this. I know some other people will say, oh, we stop spiritualizing everything. Why are you people fighting oh, Prophet T.B. Joshua? He's dead now. Okay. If I ask people, I've asked some few people online, why they are fighting squad? The only thing they have as an answer to them that they cannot substantiate or prove is that they are doing fake miracles. They are brainwashing. That's all they say. Now, if they say brainwashing or miracle fake, how about them now analyzing the genuine miracles that happen every now and then? in different other places we should come out here sincerely and talk about this thing now i'm, I'm not just talking about squan i'm talking about the general perspective of how people talk about genuine interactions with faith of jesus christ some people say oh these are not genuine prophets these are not genuine men of god okay what is genuine and what is not genuine come out and talk to us on it you see, I realized I could come in to criticize people, but when it comes to criticizing the faith we stand for, it's a little different. Well, those people that are attacking Squan and attacking uh, T.B. Joshua, attacking Mama Evelyn, they are kind of going a little far, a little further than what they are really representing. The claims they are giving and the things they are talking about is definitely colliding. They are not genuine. They are not legit in what they are doing. Email uh, inbox. Now, these are YouTube 22 messages. That is 22 uh, videos deleted. Now, I read for you as you see YouTube has removed your content. And uh, this is the uh, direction. Hi, Blevoy TV. We wanted to let you know that our team reviewed your content. Now, YouTube at 6 a.m. in the morning, that is to me writing a message. YouTube. Hi, Blevoy. We wanted to let you know that our team reviewed your content and we think it violates our community guidelines. We know that you may not have realized that this was a violation of our policies. So we are not applying a strike to your channel. However, we have removed the following content from YouTube video. Must watch a year old episode of The Office that still resonates today. Uh -huh. Now I want to show you this, all this, uh, this, this is a, these are, these are the, the, the episodes that have been removed by YouTube. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, and twenty-two. Now, funny enough to me, their policy uh, violation is definitely all videos concerning Squan. Now, let's see the first video. The first video, Squan reunite reunion service was on fire that was a video episode dated 5th december 2021 now let's go to another one the second video that uh, we are talking about here that uh, has violated policies of youtube is mama evelyn joshua outstandingly speaks there is time for every season so that's also squad related another one number three video Number three video is Mama Evelyn Joshua has gradually taken charge of Squan. Now, that's also a violation to YouTube. And uh, let's see the fourth one. And it continues just like this. The fourth one talks about uh, Blood of Jesus service replay at reunion service by Evelyn Joshua. Now, I want you to follow that trend and see something going on. 
uh, a must watch a year old episode of the office you see these things they are all kind of uh, related to in fact not related they are all youtube channels that talk about squan this is another uh, video episode they they brought down mama evelyn joshua welcomes back prophet rasim you see uh, this one everything concerning uh, <laughs> uh, squan now let's get another one mama evelyn joshua saw prophet rasim and prophet tb joshua together in a vision squan now this is another episode so we've been talking with this and referring to the previous episode so they they are taking it by themselves <coughs> excuse me they are taking them to bring down all these channels now what does that tell you they are not striking the channel but they are removing the videos i appreciate that uh, but still uh, it's biased whatever war they have with them these are just episodes we do a uh, youtube should also come out clear and talk to us about this because if they have warfare with squad we are just we place these things in where we can have now if 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 you can take a closer look at some of these contents you see this round here is talking about uh, some of the policies now what is the policy violated what our policy says contents that violate youtube stamp and services and that encourages others to do so is not allowed on youtube this includes posting contents previously removed for violating our terms of service posting content from creators with a current channel restriction or posting contents from creators who have been terminated under our terms Posting such contents is considered circumvention under our terms of service and may lead to YouTube channel being penalized or terminated. You see, that's now what they are talking about. So that means any video that was once in Emmanuel TV was once officially in Squan. If you play it here, downloaded from there, that is it will be removed what does you say go to the comment section and talk to us speak to us about this thing and let's see what happens timothy profitable and this is blevoy we handle your spirituality economic and social matters see you in the next episode